Hey guys, so last video we looked at the my uh, burner phone and my burner account, you know, a, a, an account made about two weeks ago, and we see that uh, 8640 minutes, so that's exactly six days. It was able to get gold for six days, and this account is brand new and fresh. Today, though, I wanted to talk about something that you may have not, you know, uh, heard about, which is the daily quests are actually done much better at the lower stages, specifically below stage 500. So because this is a new burner account um, it, from two weeks ago, new, <laughs> it's only at stage 40. Uh, it will never hit past stage 200. It just doesn't have the power to, to do it, which is fine because anything under stage five, 500, I believe the game gives you a huge boost in um, in, in rewards for the daily. Uh, so so, what, so what, what do I mean by that? Let's first look at an account that is way past um, stage 500. So this is one of my alts, Moon Nine, <laughs> and we and we're gonna we're, we're gonna lock her in, and we're gonna actually look at the uh, daily rewards. She's on the last part of her daily rewards. So oh wait, first let's look at the screen here. So she was offline for 240 minutes, which is about four hours. Yeah, and in four hours she made 33k gold. Uh, it's because her stage is so high. Uh, her gold per minute is a lot better, right? How much is that? Um, seven seventy gold, seventy gold, or seven hundred gold per minute, right? Yeah, that's a lot actually, compared to this guy, which is like thirty gold. Yeah, like the order, mag the order of magnitude is pretty huge, and she gets reverse points, of course, which is always nice, and uh, uh, she gets silver because. I've done the quests, and you know this is kind of like a min like a mini game here. This is it doesn't take anything special. It's really just you just have to remember to do it, and as long as you invest <laughs> invest in the uh, in the quests, you'll get pro progressively exponentially more. So it's a really kind of it's kind of a dumb mini game to be honest. But but anyways, you know we can we can come here, we can find the rewards. We'll we'll get it. We'll get we'll get all that, and then I'm gonna go and spend the reverse points on my main character, which is Kif the Knight. Cool. Anyways, uh, but that's not what I, to, what I wanted to tell you. I wanted to tell you about the daily quest. Look, so da the daily quest for this day is um, then PvP battles. And you can see that there's easy, medium, and hard. I'm on 11 out of 12 for hard. Um, and after completing hard, I'll get a measly 100 on honor points. It's not bad, right? Uh, but it's not great because I realized that if your account is under stage 500, like this guy here, Oh, whoops, uh, I don't need that. Right, well, first let's you know skip past all of this. If you are under stage traveler, if you go to the day, to the daily daily rewards, you'll see that easy, medium, hard. Well, we're at easy, and it's you only have to do one PvP battle, and the reward is already one hundred. You know what? Let's go do that. So we're gonna go to PvP. We're gonna oops PvP. I, I can't see with my phone in front of me. Sorry. All right, I'm gonna do this. All right, it wants me to give a name. Let's you know ourselves. This this guy is one two one. Oops, one two one. Okay, update the setting. Good. Uh, we're gonna do a uh, beginners, right? All right. Uh, watch. We're gonna fight. Hopefully, we win because you only get the points if you win. Oh, I don't think I don't think we're gonna win. Crap. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, we don't win that, but that's fine. Uh, we can't we we can't help ourselves. We can help ourselves by doing uh, by getting some better gear from the starter. There's some um, starter gear, I believe. Did, am I already wearing it? Yeah, I'm already wearing it. Oh my goodness. Okay, so well, there's something else I can do. Something else. I know today the daily shop. You see the sell button there. Today's daily shop has a a staff, huge upgrade, and a bow. Another huge upgrade. We're gonna buy bows, and we're gonna go and we're gonna upgrade our archer with this. Um, Wait, all right. Claim it. I hate I hate how it goes to the mail. Why can't it just go into my inventory, right? I wanna no not no the archer is it? Yeah, the archer will get that. Let me put the other bow on the back on the on the, on the other on the other thing and then we're gonna go to our mage and uh equip it. Perfect. Alright, now we, we should uh you know let's do a let's actually do a weekly PV since we already did the beginner, let's do a weekly one. All right, please win. <laughs> I really want to win here. I'm. Oh no, jeez. Okay, the count's too weak. I, yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, you have. Do I have? Oh, I have one more tip. Okay, let's do one more beginner. 
please win. I have one more ticket left. Like, I have to win this. If I don't, I can't. I can't. Well, you have to take my word for it. Ooh, this looks pretty good, actually. Come on. Oh, no. No, oh, the knight's dying. Oh, yes. Shoot him. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, guys. We did it. We did it. We did it. Okay. Okay. Uh, look, at the, look at the rewards. Come down here. One out of one. You're done. Claim. Medium is another one battle, and now it's 200. And take my word for it, the, um, actually, don't, you don't need to take my word for it. You can just, hold on, let me, let me, uh, grab this. Oh, wait, no, let me grab the reward. And, oh, and actually, the first, just the FYI, the first thing you should do with honor points is always buy more tickets. So, more dungeon tickets, like maximum dungeon tickets and maximum PvP. So, now my, uh, dungeon ticket is out of three. Yeah. And my PvP, uh, my dungeon and PvP is out of three tickets. Anyways, you don't need to take my word for it. We can go to, um, we can go to uh, one of my other accounts while that's loading. Let's look at this guy. Yeah, he's on the last stage, and he only gets 100, whereas this, whereas a, a noob account gets 100, and then 200, and then 300. Here, I'll show you what I mean. So I have another account, Moonpire122, this guy. Yeah, once he loads, I'll show you. But first, let's go, you know, let's go finish this quest here, or this daily reward. We're just going to do a random we're just gonna rent, do, a, do, do We're just gonna do, do a, a random fight. We, we, sh we should win because this account is decently strong. I don't know what that's going. That's loading. Uh, well, I didn't see the name, but anyways, here we did it. Um, which means, let's see. Uh, here we go. All right, so we claim it. That's it. We're done. That the the daily quest for a, an account that's greater than stage five hundred only gave me a total of two hundred and twenty honor points. Whereas uh, my other dude, uh, my other, this is my second burner account. Uh, he would log in an hour ago, only four or seven ago, right? Not, nothing too strong, but he has some reverse points because his stage is high. Anyways, we're going to skip past. I mean, it always, if you never finish the tutorial, it'll always try to prompt you to do it. But anyways, we go to PVP again. Oh, wait, before we do that, let's look. This guy is on the last stage. See, he is on the, he finished medium and now he has to do one more for the hard stage. No, one more for the medium stage, and he'll get 200. And then if he finishes this, he'll get 300. So we're, we're hoping to win a fight. I'm, I'm thinking beginner is probably easiest. Um, yeah, if we can win this fight, we will complete the medium level of the daily quest. Oh, can we do it? Please. Oh, my God. This is going to be close. No. Oh, we. I think we got it. Yeah. I think we got it. Boom. Very nice. All right, watch. Go here, 200. Now, if we complete this, 300. So, uh, an account below stage 500 will get 300 plus 200 plus 1, 600 honor points if you get this daily. And this daily happens pretty often. 600 honor points is huge. Like, one strategy I should have done was cut all my accounts below stage 500 and just farm these honor points. Honor points are the one thing you cannot buy. It, you have to get it from PvP. You, you, and you, and look, you, look, dungeon, uh, PvP tickets, you can't buy them. That's it. Whereas dungeon tickets, dungeon tickets, you can actually buy them. Uh, how do I buy? Oh, I have to use. The, oops. Oh crap. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to use. I wanted to use up my dungeon tickets to show you that you, you can actually use gems to buy dungeon tickets, which means theoretically you could buy as many dungeon tickets as you want. But but um, uh, but PVP tickets are locked behind time. Uh, you can only. You, hold on, let me just sweep all of this. Sweep, sweep, sweep. Okay. Okay. Ready. Watch. So you can click on the plus here, and it will say, "Hey, you want to purchase dungeon tickets? Like you can go and like, did I? Yeah, see, I, I just bought three dungeon tickets. I should not have done that because I wasted my gems. But you know what? Whatever. Um, <laughs> that was so stupid. Why did I do that? Uh, all right. Uh, but in PvP, if, if I use it up, I mean, let let's use it up. Let's do one more fight. If I if I use it on my PvP, I can't buy it. And you can't. The only thing you can't buy honor points in the store with gems. The only thing you can do is is wait. So. Basically, honor points are super hard to farm. It, it is the time gate. Like, if someone plays, um, like, a year before you, his honor points, you'll never catch up. It's just impossible. Like, I, I think that's one design flaw of the game. But, you know, it, it is what it is. But, yeah, what, anyways, what I'm trying to say is this is one way to, to catch up. If you stay at stage 500 and you get a lot of these uh, honor point events, 300 honor points is equivalent of, like, three days of PvP. It's a lot. And... You know, of course, we're going to go spend it by buying more ticket spaces. So I'm going to buy that. Oops. 
just oh wait I can't because it's in my mail again. Like I hate this system. Why is it in my mail? You know why can't I just why can't I just go to my inventory? Like what's with this mail stuff? I don't get it. Anyways, yeah. See now this account now has uh four you know four four maximum tickets and then four of those. I mean we might as well just sweep this. Doesn't matter since we spent like four hundred gen for that. Like that was so stupid. Anyways, um. Yeah, that covers the topic, which is to say, you know, a newbie account, sometimes you, you, you if you're at stage 499 and you think you can break past it, uh, maybe take a, take a bit and think about, like, do you actually want to do that at that moment? Because once you get past it, you, your quest, instead of doing three PvP to finish the whole the whole daily quest, now you have to do, um, hold up, now, now you have to do, what is this, what is this here, 12, and then medium was 8, easy was uh, six. So you have to do like s 26 PvP, which is 13 hours of PvP. Or 13 hours of waiting for PvP tickets. But you have to log in like um, every like two hours to use to use them up. It's actually a pretty big time sink if you level up. Like the daily, some of the daily quests become really un undoable once you level up the stages. And really like the game designer should really like, you know, fix that. Like it's not rewarding leveling up. It's actually punishing you. Yeah, so if you're the developer of this um, game, I mean, first of all, great game. Uh, I love it. Um, I think one of the best idle games out there. But, you know, there's a lot of room for improvement, and I really hope some of these, like, more buggy, like, you know, the buggy feature I mentioned last week about um, uh, the dungeon tickets going overflowing, <laughs> that probably should get fixed, too. I mean, if you, like, if you know the bug, it's, at, it's an advantage, right? Anyways, um, yeah, that's it for this video guys i uh, hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, i'll see you in the next one cheers